Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Leos. This is going to be your daily reading for your general energies and also for your love energies, Leos. Let's see what's coming up for your general energies first, guys, before we move on to your love energies, Leos. What is coming up for your general energies, Leos? We have the temperance, three of wands, ace of wands, seven of pentacles. Okay, so I don't know why I'm getting this, but the energy that I'm getting here is that you don't, you you can hear stuff, you can see stuff, but then you won't kind of react to certain things in your life. You feel like uh, you don't have to react to things that are not worth it and therefore you stop reacting too much to things that you feel like you shouldn't react to or you feel like it's just a wa waste of your time reacting and it's a waste of your emotions and all of that. So that's what I generally get for you here with these cards. You just feel like you should stop reacting to things that no longer serves you you should stop reacting and behaving a certain way um, how you should be okay you feel like you need to stop reacting to certain things and so what i'm getting here for you leos is that you feel like something is changing you also want to take care of yourselves like health wise so you're taking care of yourselves okay of, of your looks maybe you want to look much better so you kind of go for shopping or you start using a different face mask or like you're just uh, concentrating more on your looks okay so that is what i get for you here guys my lovely Leos, you will be concentrating more on your looks and you even like ask people to do the same because like hence you are concentrating on your looks you want the people around you to also kind of like look better and therefore you might notice that people around you are encouraging you to look a certain way okay so this is what i get for you here with these cards guys with the temperance again this is a very strong card you guys are really spiritual okay and you know whatever it takes in order to accomplish certain things in life you just want to be this person who's accomplishing a lot of things okay you don't want to be someone who's really stupid and sad and sick instead you want to be this person who's ready to do whatever it is in life and you want to be this person who's ready to achieve in life okay you not only want to achieve a lot of things from life you just want to make um things right in your situation you want everything to turn out the way you actually wish things would turn out to be okay you want to you want to get certain things done in a certain way and you will be kind of like putting your time effort and everything into things that you want to get done okay so that is what i generally see for you here you might really think some things in life are not really giving you that happy energy but you still want to accomplish certain things because you feel like everything will kind of like come into this stage once you learn from it so you're learning from a lot of different things you might be a very inspirational person for people around you they feel like People around you are like thinking about you all the time. It might be your kids, it might be your husband, it might be your 
uh, what to say, your mom, dad, your sister, brother, it can be anyone who's kind of like thinking all the time about you, really wants you in their life, okay? This person, what I'm also getting is, this person is not just thinking about you guys, okay? They're just scared to lose you, okay? They're scared to um, lose you, I don't know why, but this person is really wanting to stay with you forever, okay? They really want this union to work out. So it might be your uh, person who's thinking like this about you, but people around you kind of love you and they feel like they couldn't get any love from others and therefore like they're kind of dependent on you and they love you for who you are, what you are, and therefore they don't want to lose you, okay? So that is the main vibe I get from this particular situation guys let's see what's coming up for your love energies for your person's energies and for your energies my lovely leos for your person's energies leos so first i'll be taking cards for your person's energies for your energies okay guys so with these cards for your person's energies all i'm getting here is that this person is really brave okay they're trying to get things right in the environment they're trying to change themselves i see here this person is not just someone who kind of likes you okay this someone definitely has a crush on you. They really want to develop with you, okay? But at the same time, I don't get any kind of a negative energy. Even though the Empress is in reverse, maybe this person doesn't want this committed relationship right now. Maybe they don't want this union right now. But what I'm also getting here with this person is that even though they don't want this union right now, they will want it in the future because we have the Prince of Swords, the Empress in reverse, we have all the cards in reverse here so this person doesn't really know what to do with their life right now and they're trying to figure things out okay like exactly like how you are going to be so i see here that you guys are going to be similar to this person okay your energy is also going to be similar to this person okay whatever you're doing is uh, going to kind of like affect you so things that you're going to be doing in life things that you feel like you need to accomplish definitely is going to get you into a lot of satisfaction and a lot of positivity so just keep doing whatever you feel like doing and i think like if you do whatever you feel like doing you will manifest that awesome amazing energy okay so this is what i generally get for you here guys so i hope you get the overall energies my lovely leos so for you guys i see here there's a thrilling new beginning coming up okay this person really is losing their minds because they kind of left you and then they went and then the life turned out to be so bad and they really didn't realize that they actually wanted a life so bad like this they actually wanted a good life okay but they really feel bad right now they don't know what to actually do with a particular situation that they're involved in they're really sad and sick with the general energies okay so that is what i get for you here guys for these cards i hope you get the overall energies so this is what i feel for you here guys something new is coming up in your life it might be a person a new job or something that is uh, close to your heart okay so just keep doing whatever it takes in order to accomplish and i definitely see here that that's a new beginning coming up and it's going to come so soon so just stay tuned for the new beginning don't expect too much or don't try to think that a 
you want certain things to accomplish a certain way and don't really get sick with the overall energy things will turn out to be according to your expectations but all i'm trying to say is that don't stay really 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 like um focused on certain things and leave the important part of your life okay trying to focus on every single aspect try to focus on yourself focus on how you need to improve yourself try to focus on certain things so that your life will be much better instead of just focusing on this person okay and i think some of you have even learned this so this is all i see for you here guys your lucky color for today is brown and your lucky crystal for today is moonstone bye guys see you all tomorrow hi